Hi everyone and welcome back to a new episode of Beirut Buzz. This podcast is brought to you by Beirut.com. Uh, it's the Lebanese news and entertainment website. Uh, today I'm uh, having a conversation with Yusuf Jalmanos. Uh, he is the CEO and the head of the French department in uh, Eucalypto. It's a new Lebanese publishing house that just launched uh, a few months ago. Hello Yusuf. Hello Lynn. How are you? Fine, and you? Um, so Yusuf, before we dive deep into uh, the startup founded, um, tell us more about you, what do you do in life, and how um, did this idea come to life, actually? Okay, so I, um, I've always uh, been, uh, I've been writing since I was five or six. And uh, I've been writing uh, novels, short stories, uh, scripts. And in parallel, I work as a video editor and post producer. So um, I've been trying for years to have my books published. Some of them were published with success. But uh, throughout the years, I uh, noticed how difficult it was to be published, to have your book uh, published the way you want them to be. Facing all the difficulties of traditional publishing, I soon realized that self-publishing was a good solution. And after having tried self-publishing for myself, I thought about uh, generalizing this process to other authors, and which meant founding, fa- fa- founding a publishing company of my own. Mm-hmm. And the company um, you, you founded is really one of a kind. And what makes it so special are mainly three features. Um, It's fair, one, two, it's eco-friendly, and three, it's uh, non-discriminatory. So um, can you please tell us more about each of these characteristics? Yes, definitely. Uh, So we'll we'll start with the fair aspect. We we are fair on several levels. First of all, towards our, our authors and all our contributors. We believe that all the contributors of a book should be rewarded with the profits, and this is what we do. Uh, We work on a share-based profit, and uh, all our contributors are rewarded from the book sales. And um, and we are also fair to our readers by um, working very, very hard on the, uh, first of all, by selecting good manuscript by selecting good titles and working very hard on them to make them even better and to bring them to the highest editorial standards. And uh, last but not least, we are also fair and equitable uh, towards our environment because all our printed books are uh, only produced on demand. Um, We we do not print uh, stocks. We print each uh, book is printed when the user orders it. So uh, we are. This brings us to the second point you you mentioned. We are also an eco-friendly company. We do not waste paper. We we only print books when they are needed, when they they are ordered. And on top of this, we dedicate a percentage of the profits that are made through our uh, printed book sales and we uh, give back this uh, percentage to the last point you mentioned is the, the, is the non-discriminatory aspect of eucalypto yes we are uh, definitely inclusive and uh, one of the our first three titles uh, is the first uh, lesbian romance told by a lebanese author so it's uh, sama the best detective novel ever written by patricia mukherzel and we are very proud of this. And uh, beyond this uh, novel itself... Okay, um, so you mentioned that uh, some of uh, the profits uh, uh, go to uh, towards organizations um, that actively work on, um, on eco-friendly projects. Um, what are some of those organizations? Uh, the main one is Canopy. Canopy. Okay. Okay. Um, so the company was founded by Lebanese people. Is it based in Lebanon as well? 
it is registered in Cyprus, but uh, the majority of the editorial team uh, lives in Lebanon and works from Lebanon. Okay, nice. Um, so, do you handle all the publishing process from A to Z, including editing, designing? Um, Yes, definitely. We handle all the publishing process from A to Z, except the printing and distribution of the paper uh, copies, of course, because we outsource it uh, to a specialized platform. We handle all the publishing process except the printing and distribution. We have an outsource company who takes uh, care of this, and this is what allows us to be present worldwide and uh, to be available in five different formats. Apart from this, we do all the editorial work, the revisions, the corrections. We can coach authors depending on uh, how much their project. Uh, if, if someone has already um, a design in their mind or um, they want to design their, their covers, for example, themselves, um, how does that work? Do they present it to the design team and um, they approve of it? It can work this way, yes. Uh, we can uh, work together on the idea, brainstorm the idea and uh, uh, we are very flexible uh, on uh, this point, on this matter, and on other ones. So uh, any author can propose uh, his own cover, and uh, we will work it with, with our design team. And uh, in case the author have contributed to their own cover, they will also see their um, shares of the profits raised. Mm -hmm. And so far, you um, publish books in two languages, if I'm not mistaken, French and English. Um, yes. So are you planning on uh, publishing books in Arabic language? Unfortunately, not for the moment. Uh, first of all, Arabic language is much more complicated to adapt on ebooks and fluid text. Technically, it's a much, much more complicated process. And to tell you honestly, uh, in our team, we don't have any good uh, Arabic editors. So since we talked about uh, the e-books, uh, e um, how can people uh, buy their e-books? Uh, is it through the website? Um, is there a subscription, for example? Our e-books are sold via the website. You have to create yourself an account to buy the books, but no subscription is needed. You buy each book by, uh, by itself. Uh, okay, okay. And um, the prints are only done on demand? Yes. Mm -hmm. um, also, I wanted to ask you, um, I was reading uh, the website and in the profits, divisions, description, that's on the website. It says that 2.5% um, of the profits are allocated to something called fair pot. Um, so what is exactly a fair pot? The fair pot is an idea that came from our concept itself. Our concept being a publishing company that belongs to its authors. What is the fair pot? From the sales of each book, a small percentage is taken, put in the fair pot, and then it's redistributed to all Eucalyptus authors. This way, if we have one bestseller, all our authors will benefit at least a bit from it. Okay. How can aspiring writers submit their manuscripts for you to review them? We have a dedicated page on our website where anyone can upload a project and they will be asked to specify the synopsis, the motivation note and a few other info. Okay. And um, how many published authors are on the website so far? We have three published authors for the moment and we have several other projects that are being prepared. Are there any uh, future projects or features that uh, you guys want to add to the website? For the moment, the website offer, uh, offers the reader the possibility to read the first chapter online. Mm -hmm. And if you have any other proposition, we can consider it. 
<laughs> I don't want myself. Mm-hmm. Um, maybe people who are listening to this podcast can submit um, their propositions as well. Um, Later on, we'll have a comment section. But uh, for the moment, people can comment on the social media. Ah, they can. So you have social media um, accounts. Yes. And we have, uh, we even have uh, one publication dedicated to each book. So um, at the end of each book, uh, the reader can be redirected. At the end of each book, we have a list of URLs and links and QR codes in the case of uh, printed books. And those links lead to our, uh, to our website, either to our website or to the social media dedicated to this book. So when the reader gets to the last pages of, of our books, he has, they have the option to be redirected to our website to discover our other books or to leave a comment or a message re- concerning the book they just have read. All right, that's, that's really helpful for them and for the authors as well. What else can I ask you? <laughs> um, is there any uh, any uh, uh, thing that you want to um, pinpoint or uh, something that you would like people to know about uh, about the website and the whole initiative? Okay, I'd like just to remind that we are re- uh, we are very innovative. We are the first publishing company in the world that uh, to offer our books worldwide in two different languages, in five formats, and at affordable prices. So this is really an important part of our identity because we are really a first of its kind publishing company. A second point that I would like to pinpoint is that uh, we'd like to encourage users to uh, keep in mind that being innovative, we also have an innovative way of dealing with customers. And uh, we believe that with time, everyone will get used to buying from our website and the buying a eucalyptus book will become as simple as doing groceries. We need a bit of time, but uh, any innovative project needs a bit of time. Yes, of course. And um, I have uh, one uh, one more question. Um, so the books published on the website are also divided into uh, collections, if I'm not mistaken. So, so what are those um, those collections? We'd rather, we prefer not talking about the collection for the moment, because for the moment we just have one collection. The okay. others will come later and we, we prefer keeping it as simple as possible to the audience. Okay, good. Um, so, Yusuf, which audience are you uh, targeting uh, exactly? Okay, so we are not targeting any specific audience in particular. We have started with uh, three. Uh, we have started with three novels in very different styles and genres, and each one, um, each one will have its own audience. You may not like all our books, but at least one is for you. So, Yusuf, I want to thank you so much for being on this podcast and for answering all our questions. And we are really so thankful for um, Lebanese people like yourself who are giving uh, our young aspiring uh, writers a great opportunity to put their work out there. For anyone who has a script ready, Send it to Eucalyptus website linked in the description. And for all book lovers, this is the ideal platform for you, whether you live in Lebanon or abroad. Eucalyptus books are available online and can be shipped worldwide. And as their slogan says, you might not like all of our books, but at least one is for you. Be sure to follow and rate our podcast if you enjoy it. Beirut Buzz is available on Apple, Google, Facebook Podcasts, and Spotify, as well as our YouTube channel, Beirut Videos. So leave us a comment letting us know what you think, and subscribe for more.